In today's screencast, I'm going to walk through the new integration between Open Nebula and Prometheus, which was released with Open Nebula Enterprise Edition version 6.6. .6. It's an integration that brings a new level of visibility into your cloud by providing and presenting detailed metrics about your virtual machines and your underlying infrastructure. The plan here is to cover how to set up and use both Open Nebula and Prometheus in tandem. So first, I'm going to take a quick look at how to install and configure the Prometheus integration. Then I will show a demo on how to add and visualize the data collected by Prometheus using Grafana. And finally, we'll take a look at how the alert manager system works. Now, this integration consists of four components. An Open Nebula exporter, which provides basic information about the overall Open Nebula cloud. A libvirt exporter that provides information about the VM running on an Open Nebula host. So in other words, the, the KVM domains. Alert rules sample files based on the provided metrics by Open Nebula. And finally, a Grafana dashboard to visualize VM, host, and Open Nebula information in a graphical and convenient way. Okay. The installation of these components is, is very simple. It is only necessary to install the packages indicated in the guide that you can find in the Open Nebula documentation. Uh, this guide will provide you with the necessary details in case you already have a P Prometheus installation and want to use it with Open Nebula as well. Okay, I'm going to start with the configuration of Prometheus and Grafana. So here you can see the Grafana login screen. Once you have the packages installed and the services started as indicated in the documentation, the next step is going to be to install Grafana and connect it to our Prometheus instance. Okay, so Grafana is an open source dashboard and visualization tool, which you can use to create dynamic and intuitive dashboards. It can be installed from its official website where you can download the packages that correspond to your operating system. Okay, so let's log into Grafana and see how we can get the setup going. All right. So here we can see the Grafana home screen. At the moment, it's empty. So we're going to add the information that we extract from the Prometheus in integration with Open Nebula. For that, we need to add Prometheus as a new data source. And it should be very easy to do that. So what we need to do is go to configuration, right? Select add data source. Obviously select the add data source button here and complete the form specifying the configuration of your Prometheus instance. Okay, so we'll and essentially enter the local host URL and save it. There you have it. All right, so now we have our previous instance added to Grafana. Here it is. Okay. So now we need to add dashboards in order to visualize the information that Prometheus collects. All right, so you can find some predefined dashboards in your front end node in the path of USR share one Grafana dashboards. Okay. To import them, you only have to copy their content and within the Grafana interface, go to dashboards, import, right? And then you add the copy, the content selecting as a source, the Prometheus instance that we added previously. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Now, once that's done, you'll be able to see in real time all the metrics obtained by Prometheus. All right, so you can take a look at the dashboard that we just added. You can see that the dashboard contains several panels that display metrics such as CPU usage, memory usage, and disk usage of the OpenAbula hosts. These files are fully configurable, so you have the freedom to adapt them according to your needs. Now, the last component of this integration is the alert manager. Okay. Now, alerts obviously are a great way to monitor your cloud infrastructure and receive notifications when specific events occur. 
the alert manager is part of the Prometheus distribution, right? And should be already installed in your system after completing the installation process. So to configure an alert, you first need to define its trigger condition. This can be done using a combination of operators and thresholds. Uh, an example would be to, to create an alert that triggers when a VM's CPU usage exceeds uh, 80% for more than five minutes, right? So that's, that's an example. Okay, but what you'll see here is that Open Nebula provides a set of predefined alerts for a wide range of events, right? Such as virtual machine creation, deletion or migration, host state changes or, or storage problems. You can set, also set up custom alerts based on metrics such as CPU usage or memory consumption. Okay, so you can find all the available metrics in the documentation. At this point, I really hope this was helpful, at least to showcase how simple it is to manage and monitor your Open Nebula Cloud infrastructure using Prometheus and Grafana. Um, I will make sure to include all the necessary documentation in the video description. So thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.